Hello. Arch. Thank you. Hi. Welcome it's great back. To be back. I'm over on the couch. I know. You last time you were here, you did stand up. I You're, did, which you know is an indignity in some senses. Like, what do you mean? Well, you know, to come out and go eh, and laugh, you know, that, that sort of thing. It's um, it's scary, mean? Jimmy. You know. Yeah, but it's fun. You you were great. Oh, I mean, I was yes, I was absolutely fantastic. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, I love doing stand up here. Um, and you I always, loved. Did you always know that you wanted to do stand up? Oh. Um, because I think that this little girl acting, wanted yeah. to be an actress, I feel like. Look at this. That's a little headshot there. Now, what was you? Oh, my God. Um, I, I just want to say that what happened to me last time here was kind of interesting. Oh, what? Because okay, I came out, and we practiced the set all around town. At, it was four minutes. There were, like, four and a half minutes tops, you know, and I, like, tried it out and the, the whole thing. And then I got here, and I came out, and I couldn't tell if the crowd was, like, feeling me. So I was like, I, I kind of needed to work with them. And so it ended up being, like, six and a half minutes. Why was it six and a half minutes? Because I added a few spins. I do remember you added yeah, a couple spins. Yeah, just like, um... <laughs> I mean, well, yeah. you know what I mean? That's your move. I, yeah, and that I you, felt it, like it made everyone more comfortable. I don't know, because it's like, you know, it's scary, because like, even though they can't see the audience, you know, they know they're on film even though they're not. You know, it, they feel uh, they're performing. The audience is performing. Yeah, like that was... Them performing. Absolutely. And so, like, I thought it was beautiful. I think they did a great job. Yeah. yeah. I mean, should we all get up and do one twirl? Yeah. Let's do it. Can we get the lights up? Let's all do it. It's, it's going to feel good. You're going to feel good. On the count of three, ready? One, two, three. Oh my God. Fantastic. Happy New Year, everybody. Happy 2020. Happy New Year. Happy 2020. Uh, pal. You... Yes, I, I, um, <laughs> The, oh you were the best. <laughs> the commercial, uh, the commercial was not where I got my uh, artistic sort of satisfaction. It was more um, at you know the ele elementary school, uh, the talent shows, etc. What were you into? Is it? Uh, Les Mis, primarily. That was. <laughs> yes, um, it was huge. It was huge for the nation, but it was huge for me. <laughs> my greatest moment um, still was probably uh, my performance of Little Gavroche in the second grade. A couple of my friends said, hey, we're all doing Annie, we're all doing Hard Knock Life, you well, know, good. let's all play the orphans, etc." And I just, it was awkward, but I had to say, no, 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 um, I'm, I'm gonna enlist my dad uh, to play the piano and I'm doing Little Gavroche solo. You People broke always, out solo. No, they want to make you part of the chorus when, you know. Yeah. And you were ready to be a star. Yeah, I knew I was. You know what's funny? Yeah. We actually got footage of you performing. Well, that's very sneaky. <laughs> okay. Let me talk to your dad. I really do. I want to show everyone. Here's Jacqueline in her second grade talent show. This is real. Take a look at this. <laughs> I'm so proud of it. And, and now, honestly, now look at look at us. Look at you know? now. But now you're 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 off Broadway. Yes. You're, you're, I mean, man, the reviews for your show really? is unbelievable. Let me tell you a little something about. I will. I'd love uh, to get hear. on your knees. Uh, New York Times critics pick on their best of theater 2019. Time out, New York. <laughs> Novak's winning show oh does what the best comedy can do. It changes the conversation. <laughs> New York Magazine clearly her masterwork. <laughs> Vanity Fair, get on your knees, uh, solidifies her place as a comedic powerhouse. No. The rest of the world just needs to catch up. Oh my God. Bang! Yes, yes. Can you explain what, uh, what, what the show is? Uh, in theory, it's about blowjobs. Just okay. Say it. In, in theory, okay. Well, you know, uh, and they, they gasped as though, you know, it's a certain kind of show. But, but truly, it's very highbrow, it's very literary. Um, you know, it, it's spiritual. Um, some people say, you know, because they, they, they see the title and they go, oh, oh, I, I know what it's about. And I go, prayer. You know what I mean? Just because I don't think that they should assume, to me, the blowjob, and I'm only going to say it one more time, I think, that phrase. Sure. Because I think we get two to three and then we're out, right? I, I, I sure, yeah, I think so. <laughs> But yeah. to me, it's more about uh, the blowjob as a sort of, um, well, I think it can be a rigorous spiritual practice if you consider it as an opportunity to exercise the virtue of humility. That's, yeah, that's a great sell, that's a great selling point. Sure, absolutely. Is, is it, have your, has your dad seen the show? Oh, yeah, mom and dad have seen it, uncles have seen it. I actually um, brought Inside My Shape where my dad, <laughs> 
my dad's... Inside your shapewear. <laughs> yeah, well, you know. Yeah. Uh, some call it lingerie. I, why, why hide? Um, <laughs> my dad sent an email to my uncle who was coming to the show. They were bringing... The whole family was coming to the show. And I didn't know that he sent this until after, but I feel like it's a good selling point for the show, so sure. I'm just going to read it. Yep. Uh, this is to my uncle Mark. He said... My dad said, Hi, Mark. So great to see you guys got tickets to Jacqueline's show. Get on your knees. I wanted to, quote, warn you. There's a quote. <laughs> that her, what, 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 yeah, yeah. What? I wanted to warn you, as you can tell by the title, that her show contains strong sexual themes, is graphic, and highly personal. As Jacqueline has said herself, it is like going to a strip show, but even more intimate. <laughs> this is material they would never allow on The Tonight Show. <laughs> it will not be everyone's cup of tea. <coughs> Balancing this off, however, is that her show is also witty, highbrow, and intellectual, as is all of her material. Do you see the support? Isn't that beautiful? And then he's just said, that's all on a separate subject. Are you seeing the stones? <laughs> oh, that's good. I think they were seeing the were stones. Were they seeing the stones? Yeah. Uh, they're a great band. Yeah. Uh, I, I got to say, congrats. Everyone uh, that I've run into has seen this says, is brilliant. Go, uh, and how long is it running? It's ending we soon. No, we just extended it. You did? Yeah. yeah. Yes! yes. <laughs> That's you. big news! That's a twirl! Yeah. I'm twirling. Thank you. Yes. Jacqueline Novak, for more info on her show, go to getonyourkneesshow.com.